Hey everyone, I hope you all are doing well. It is currently Tuesday, August 7th. It is a very exciting day yeah. because we are going shopping for our first foster placement and we are just so excited. We were fully licensed on Friday, July 27th. So it's been about a week and a half since we were fully licensed. We are getting a four month old little boy and he is just the cutest little thing. We're picking him up on Thursday. So we have about two days to get ready and we cannot wait. We do know that he will be coming to us with a few things. So we're just gonna go shopping for some fun stuff and see what he has before we go out and buy a ton of stuff. But we're so excited. We cannot wait to meet him. We cannot wait to bring him home. We are just so excited. We can't wait. We feel like he's such a good match for us and we're just so excited. I know. Yay! So we're gonna take you shopping with us because I have waited for this moment for the past six years and it is finally here. We're going baby shopping! <laughs> Our first stop is at Bye Bye Baby, which is like a huge mega baby store with all kinds of stuff. Think of Bed Bath & Beyond, but for just baby. We're looking at the clothes and look how cute these Under Armour onesies are. They're so adorable. And they also have little Under Armour shorts, just like the ones Dave wears. <laughs> Those are so cute. We can dress them up like Mickey Mouse. It even has the hood. That is adorable. We're getting this. <laughs> What'd you find? I gotta get some stuff to match. Which is too cool. <laughs> gotta get a new wardrobe too. Yeah. I match the little man. One of the main things on our list is a pack and play. I like this one. This is a pack and play quick connect by Graco, $160. That's what it looks like. That actually goes with it as well. It goes on top here. They have it down here. It comes with a portable napper, a diaper changer, an infant bassinet, and a toddler play yard. So I feel like this would be good, especially for as much as we travel. I feel like it would be nice to have all of those things in one. So I think we might go with that one, but they have like Mac Daddy pack and plays. I mean, these are not the pack and plays I remember from when I was younger, that's for sure. We are now at Target. I found the perfect onesies. This one says Adventure Awaits, and then the other one says Oh, the Places You'll Go, and the nursery is a Dr. Seuss Oh, the Places You'll Go theme, so I thought that was adorable. And even though he's only four months, he's in six to nine month clothing, so he's a little chunk. Super excited. Find anything? Oh, that is cute. We love a clearance section. <laughs> okay. It's always hot here in Florida, so you can never go wrong with shorts. Look at how adorable these swaddle blankets are. They're Dumbo. So cute. I can't wait for our first Disney trip. It's gonna be so fun. We already have our cart loaded down with all kinds of fun stuff. We have little bandana bibs. We've got this for the diaper bag so nothing stinky. David picked out this super soft bear. It's so soft. You're gonna love it. We have teething books. We have Sophie the giraffe because every little one needs that. So much fun. Just throw it in there, you know? Just throw it in there. Oh, these are cute. That's all I've been saying all day. Oh, that's cute. Those are cute. Throw it in the cart. We're currently looking at bottles. And you guys, I'm feeling slightly overwhelmed. How do people know what to buy? How? I mean, I realize that when you have a baby, you don't know what you're doing either, but... What, what, I mean, <laughs> you have so many different brands, so many different styles. I've heard a lot about these bottles. My friend Dan just told me to get Dr. Brown's, but he didn't tell me what kind, so I don't know. I don't know what to do. This is overwhelming. They have Playtex. I don't know. David thinks we should start with a set. Are you feeling overwhelmed? Just me. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, we're just gonna get this set. I get a set and just start fresh. Like, that's what you do. You just get a set and start fresh. And you've got everything you need on one little thing. And then throw away what you got Let's see what's in the set. You got so a brush, can... you got a cleaner, or whatever that is. I don't even know what that is. It looks like a passy. It's probably for like. 
<laughs> right, we don't know what we're doing. <laughs> well, no. This is for... That's for formula. No, that's for formula. This, this, this. Yeah, okay, sounds great. <laughs> it tells you on the side what everything is. Three eight ounce baby bottles, storage travel caps, two four ounce baby bottles, a cleaning brush, level two silicone nipples, bottle brush, level three silicone nipples, silicone pacifier. I was right for one time. Formula dispenser, level four silicone. That's what we're getting. Oh, my Lanta. <laughs> it is now almost nine o'clock and we just finished. Whew. How do you feel? I'm tired. <laughs> I feel like a long day. <laughs> that was a whirlwind. Whew. It's hard when you only have two days to prepare, but I know a lot of people only have like an hour, so we're thankful for two days, but whew, that was a lot. I think my brain's gonna explode trying to figure out what kind of bottles you need, what kind of diapers you need. Like, that's a lot. Mom life, man. It's insane, but it's so exciting and I feel like I'm totally in my element. I love every second of it. So we're gonna go home and I'm going to show you everything that we bought probably tomorrow when I'm not so tired and it's daylight out. We just got home, we put all of the baby stuff in the family room and I went through it again and I am just so overwhelmed with emotion. I'm overwhelmed in general. I think David and I both had a little bit of a panic attack at Target just because we were just so overwhelmed. We have no idea what we're doing. We're, it's just all coming to us so quickly. Things are happening so fast. We're so excited, but so overwhelmed. I'm also just overwhelmed with the joy that I feel, the sadness that I feel. I'm excited for us. I'm excited for this journey. I'm excited to love on this baby, but I also feel sadness for him and for his family. And it's just a lot. So many emotions are involved in this, but I still feel like this is what we're supposed to do. I feel like God is telling me this is your calling. This is what I need you to do. And I strongly feel that. I cannot wait to see what happens. I loved every second of baby shopping. I don't know if we need everything that we bought. We might be returning stuff in the future, but just to go to the store and buy the things that I've been wanting to buy for the past six years, that stupid Sophie the Giraffe teether toy, I have looked at that every single time I've gone to Target and just thought one day when I have a baby, I'm gonna buy that and it's gonna be one of the first things that I buy because I just always loved it and to be able to actually put it in my cart and buy it for a baby today was like just so exciting and I'm just I'm just so excited to be a mom I didn't know that it would be in this capacity but I'm excited for it nonetheless um I strongly believe that there shouldn't be a title. It shouldn't be biological mom, foster mom, stepmom. Like, if you're a mom, you're just a mom. And I'm just so excited to be a mom. I'm so excited to love on this baby. And I'm just so excited that I'm finally getting to do all the things I've always wanted to do. And <sighs> didn't realize I would be this emotional going shopping. But I'm just so happy. I'm so, so happy. And I just can't wait to meet our little guy and love on him and just literally pour all the love that I've had in my heart for the past six years onto this baby and I just hope that he feels it and know that he's loved by us for the rest of his life no matter what happens in the future so I just wanted to share that but I'm gonna go be a little bit emotional and I'll come back and share with you guys the haul of everything we purchased today Here's a quick overview of all the fun baby items that we purchased. Please excuse the background noise. We are currently running the dishwasher. We're trying to get the house in tip top shape before little man arrives. Over here are all the items that we picked up at Bye Bye Baby. We did end up purchasing the pack and play that I showed you earlier in the vlog. We also picked up the stroller fan. We live in Florida. It's super hot. I know we'll be spending a lot of time at the park. We'll probably go to the zoo, maybe Disney a couple times. So I wanted to have this so we could attach it to the stroller to keep him from getting too hot. We also picked up this little teething mitt. One of our friends has this and says it's a game changer. You just put it on their hand, they can teeth on it. So I thought that was pretty cool. We also picked up this little teething toy that goes in the freezer. This was a David Fine. <laughs> we had to have this apparently. It is a whale shaped tub stopper. So we'll be able to use this when we give him a bath. We also picked up this little dinosaur shaped teether. We picked up this mirror that we can attach to the headrest in the back seat so that I can see him while driving. So this will go right in front of his car seat. 
And then David is a huge Miami Dolphins fan. Football season is coming up, so he had to get him some Dolphins onesies. So this is a pack of three. That's the first one. We have that gray one. And then on the other side is this orange and teal one, which is super adorable. So that's everything from Bye Bye Baby. Here's everything that we picked up at Target. We found this Tummy Time Play Mat. It was on clearance for $13.98. So it has a mirror and has some stuff that you can actually detach, some little teethers, so I thought that'd be fun. We did end up picking up this pack of uh, bottles. It's a little starter pack. We got some burp cloths. I thought these were super cute. This is actually something that David wanted, so we got that. We got these little muslin blankets just to swaddle him or just to throw in the diaper bag. You now just have on hand. This is the baby formula that he is using, Infamil Gentle Ease Infant Formula. David found this bear and wanted to give it to him. It is super soft, so we'll probably bring it when we pick him up. He's super adorable. I got this for the diaper bag. I heard it is a must. I have been watching so many What's in My Diaper Bag videos to try and get an idea of what everyone's putting in their diaper bag. So I picked one of these up just when we're out and about. If I'm changing his diaper, I can throw it in this and then throw it in the trash so it doesn't offend anyone in the bathroom because, you know, those can be rough. I also got the mommy hook. This you attach to your stroller. So when you're shopping, you can attach your shopping bags, your purse, whatever you want to it. I heard this was a must, so I picked that up. We also picked up these little passies. I'm not sure if he is using a pacifier. I have no idea, so I just picked these up for now. I figure I can always go back and get different ones if I need to. Like I said, I don't exactly know what he's coming with, so I just decided to pick up some little nail clippers and a thermometer as well. We picked up this sunscreen. I'm pretty sure you're not really supposed to use sunscreen on babies until after six months, but when we go to the pediatrician, I'll definitely ask about this. This is the Baby Ganix SPF 50 sunscreen. My sister-in-law Savannah swears by this, so I figured I would pick that up because, like I said, we live in Florida. We're out in the sun quite a bit. I got this little teething book. I heard that these are a must as well. So just one of these crinkle teething books. I thought that was fun. Of course, Soapy the Giraffe. Had to have that, you guys already know. I picked up this little formula dispenser. I like that it has three separate sections so that I can put it in here and just toss that in my diaper bag. So if we're gonna be out for a while, I have at least three bottles that I can make. This is the baby monitor that we decided to go with. I asked on Facebook what all of my friends were using and this one came highly recommended. So this is what we're gonna try out. Let me know if you guys have used this one and what you think about it. Over here we have a two pack of bandana bibs which are so cute and super soft. I cannot wait to pair this with this onesie which I absolutely love. This is my favorite find of the entire shopping trip. I was so excited to find some Dr. Seuss items. So we have this onesie which came in a two pack with this one that says Oh, the places you'll go. Love those, cannot wait to see him in that. David picked out this cute little outfit. So we just have a collared shirt with these shorts that has whales and sailboats on them. Obviously, we really like whales. I don't know how that happened. Well, we got this shirt with the whale on it with these matching shorts. And really, I just got this three-piece set because I love the onesie that was attached to it. It says, little guy, big appetite. I have not seen him in person yet, but from pictures, I feel like this is totally him. So, had to have that set. And then we got him some bathing suits. We got this one with anchors. And then I also found this shirt. And these are the SPF 50 plus. Uh, bathing suits and shirts that'll be great so we have that matching set and then this matching set which is also whale so we have the little whale uh, bathing suit shorts and then again the same little spf top that's going to be it for today's vlog i hope you all enjoyed it if you did give it a thumbs up if you have any recommendations on things you think we should have for a four to five month old boy let us know in the comment section below make sure to subscribe to my channel so you don't miss out on any exciting updates the fun is about to begin we are so excited and cannot wait to share this journey with you thank you for watching and i will see you all in my next video bye everyone